us a little bit about your operation you run here. Yeah, what we do here for, for Brett, Point Pointing Pastoral Company, we've got 700 odd backgrounders. We buy the bulls off Jim, try and hit that market around that 400 kilo sort of backgrounder weight. Peppers, steers sort of going two separate ways, but just trying to get them mature a little bit earlier. We always used to sort of just breed, run a thousand odd cows and then just do them all as weaners, but we cut our numbers back a little bit to that 760 odd breeders. And then we're sort of background and taking them through that feeder weight of 400, and we're trying to buy a few in as well, sort of outside. Queensland hasn't had a particularly good of late, so uh, how's your fertility kept up and how the bull's been working? Yeah, fertility's been really good. It's sort of getting higher. We have got a good number of bulls, um, and then all the young bulls, we sort of we made a decision to buy the younger bulls off. Jim and Jackie, I think it's paid off, like we're just letting them acclimatise here. The weaners that we've been looking at today in the yards, um, what's going to happen to them? Tell me the life cycle with those weaners. We looked at some earlier this morning, calves still on cows, they're a little bit out of season. No fault of the bulls or the cows, it was just the way we bought the cows, we've barely seen a bull a bit late. Um, so they'll come through, we'll take these little fellas here, so they'll do 12 month cycle, get them up to that 4, 420. With some other heifers here we looked at before, they're at that weight now. Yeah, they're all number fives. Milk, um, there's a couple of milk and twos, but all milk tea. Um, they're around that 400 kilos, some are four, yeah, about 390 to 430. Uh, they'll go to Brisbane Valley feedlot and then they'll be fed from, from then on for seven days. Tell me, how have you found the Ascot bulls up here handling your conditions? Yeah, Ascot bulls have handled it really well. Like I say, we've been buying the younger fellas. They've been acclimatising really good. And we're in the ticks, we're closer to the coast. I was worried about bringing them off that good downs country up here. But they've taken it in their stripes. It's been really, really good. Um, our calving percentage is great. The cattle are a lot quieter. The blokes buying our cattle are really happy. The, the breaking in the dog's really good. And we're just going through the yards. It's, they're quite the good. We're just sort of looking at bulls with that bigger hip. Because we've got Brahman cows and we're just trying to get thicker calves to get just to mature that, that earlier maturing thing, to get to that 400 kilos as quick as we can, try and turn our numbers over and, and keep going. The, the industry now is demanding these these early maturing, heavily muscled, positive fat charolade bulls, aren't they? Yeah, it's exactly right. Yeah, we're chasing them. You've only got to look at these calves. Hey, they'll, they'll, go, they'll go forward now. They've been through the mill. We've bloody our cattle here, been in the ticks. They've been bloodied. They've been, yeah, they've had probably two weeks in the yards now, so they've had a rough trot. It's, Probably the worst we'll see them from here on. So I just I'll go forward, so we'll go and leave them down. You know, yeah. We've um, been a big change. Like, the calves are beautiful and quite I've got little kids, and the kids are riding the yards. Once you give them them weaners a week in here, the kids are helping us. The cattle are great, they're quiet. Even our buyers, they've noticed a difference, which has been really, really good. And that makes a huge difference in the feedlot, too, doesn't it? Yeah, well, if they go down and they're quiet and their heads down, and they're putting on kilos every day, so that's, that's the name of the game, and that's what we're aiming at, yeah. Clint, uh, thank you so much for your time today, mate. It was a pleasure looking around. It's a great operation. Yeah, no drama. It's good to have you up here. And for you guys as well to see your bulls come in and, and see our cows and then see where they're going from there on. It's great. We can have a yarn and a beer and see where it all ends up. Yeah, beautiful. Looking forward to the beer. Done. Good, mate.